to speak on first the game that Demario had back in a place where he used to call home. Yeah, um, I mean, we talk about the way he, he played, the way he was covering, the way he made the tackles over the immediate routes. I mean, he had a hell of a game today. Um, that's, that's what we need from him every game. And uh, we talk about, you know, just the defensive standard that we set. I love the way uh, everybody started playing in that second half. Did you, get a sense, did you guys ever talk about the, the, the struggle of the franchise here against the Giants? No. Like no, no, no. We talked about how the Giants, you know, want to be bigger and tougher than everybody, and we had to be out physical in this game. We did just that. Okay, four games into the season. What do you think this team is right now? Have y'all played? Growing. Still growing. growing. Um, you know, to, to let up that touchdown at the end of the game, that's something that we have to uh, eradicate. Um, you know, I would love to have looked up and it had been 28-7. Uh, I would have loved to not let them score that first touchdown. So we, we're, we're growing in every facet still. We still got some, some ways to go. Tell me the job you did on stopping that run, Saquon. Yeah, I mean, I think we did a great job stopping the run. And all of a sudden, Eli's a pocket mover now, pocket scrambler. Well, I wouldn't call him a scrambler, but I mean, now he's navigating the pocket well instead of, you know, collapse the pocket and all of a sudden he's escaping, I guess, that happens. You guys are on Demar every day. Do you have a sense like how important this was coming back to New York for him? Yeah, I mean, it's it's another game. I mean, he knows he's a part of the, the New Orleans uh, team. So when we talk about, you know, what he has going on with the Jets, he didn't really let that, that vent out too much. You know, he was going back home to uh, win in the stadium. This, this is the most important game because it's the next game. We're going to move on after 24 hours. Did you really feel the pressure was on you? You came into the game ran 30th in defense. Do you guys feel like you had to step up? What pressure would there be then? We, we've got nowhere to go but up. So. Uh, when you talk about trying to get better as a defense, uh, we take every game as a challenge. It's something that we have to rise to the occasion. Again, we still you know, let them score first, and we let them uh, score late in the game. That's something that we want to, to eliminate that from our, uh, from our whole uh, vision of where we're trying to go. Cam, okay, four games into the season, what impresses you most about this team right now? You just missed that question, huh? That was almost, OK. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So when you talk about, um, when you talk about you know, the, play, the playmakers that we have on our team, um, Again, all of a sudden, Eli's a scrambler now. Uh, you know, last week he was sitting at you know eight to nine yards passing. All of a sudden, he's sitting at six and climbing. Um, this is something that frustrated me early on. But you talk about uh, where our defense is. You know, we're starting to get back into the groove of things. Um, and with the offense that we have, all we have to do is give them an opportunity to score, and they're they're going to hold their own.